Wing Chun breathing and how to do it in an internal way. One of the best breathing methods for beginners is to breathe through the nose. The tip of the tongue goes to the roof of the mouth, just like you're saying the letter L. And you breathe to your lower dantian. Now the lower dantian is three finger widths below the navel in the center of the body. Imagine a reservoir of energy uh, or a storage spot for your chi. Allow the air to come down to the belly, expand the belly without forcing it, okay, allowing it, relaxing, relaxing has a big part of it, relaxing the, the windpipe so you can get more air. Breathe slower and not out of desperation. Have patience, be mindful. As we're practicing our Sunum Tao or really anything in Wing Chun, we want to do this because every single thing in Wing Chun is a meditation. We don't hype ourselves up for a fight or hype, us, hype ourselves up to practice any specific drill or anything like that we meditate we cultivate we ground okay so this breathing is a big part of it now of course there are plenty of other breathing methods but when it comes to beginners i found this to be one of the most practical for them introducing my wing chun distance learning program at wingchunlessons.com Designed to help those with a sincere interest to learn Wing Chun at home. Not everyone has access to a Wing Chun school or local instructor where they live. This Wing Chun home training program also gives you a chance to become certified and recognized under the Dragon Institute ranking system, which is a necessary first step for those who wish to become certified Wing Chun instructors. Read more at wingchunlessons.com.